get to see finally how the game looks like. Okay, so we got a uh, letter from Hogwarts. We are very pleased to inform you that you have been accepted at Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry as a fifth year student. Fifth year already? Not bad. Term begins on 1st of September. Preliminary supplies have been collected for you and you will accompany you on your journey to the castle. Uh, sorry about that. As you may be aware, the decree for the reasonable restriction of underage sorcery prohibits the use of magic by those under the age of 17 outside school. Okay. However, due to unique circumstances, the ministry has graciously agreed to follow, no, to allow Professor Eleazar Fig to help you hone your spellcasting before escorting you from London to the castle for the start of term feast and a sorting ceremony. Yours sincerely, Professor Weasley, Deputy Headmistress. Okay. Alright, so now we get to create our character. What are these? Presets. I don't know, should we choose a preset or maybe should we just create our own character? I don't know, I think I will go with... With this guy? Or maybe this guy? Yeah, I'm gonna pick this guy for now. Uh, okay, so it looks like we can change our face shape from here. What do you think? This one... It looks the best out of all that we've tried so far. Oh yeah. We are definitely gonna go with some glasses. Harry Potter style ones. Perfect. Wow, that's black. I think I will go with this one. Yeah. That's perfect. Should we change the hair color maybe? I think I will go with green. Who doesn't like green though? Freckles and moles. Why not? Scars and markings. We should definitely add some scars here. I mean, even Harry Potter had a few. I mean, had one. 
face. That's the eye. Unibrow. We gotta go with the unibrow. Student, but I could it was wonderful. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class Okay, so what should be our name none other than Patent And our last name must be teacher of course Should we be a witch? We're gonna be a wizard. So now, let's get ready. Let's begin ah, our journey. It appears we are almost ready to depart. It's a pity we didn't have a bit more time to spend on spell casting. I presume you've been practicing the spells we worked on. I have, Professor. Well. I'm quite sure I've never seen anyone take so quickly to a second-hand wand. You'll be a force to be reckoned with when you get your own. Thank you, Professor Fig. I appreciate you working with me before the term begins. Oh! <laughs> Eleazar! George! Glad my rather cryptic description of our location did not thwart your finding us. I've apparated to more vaguely defined destinations than this. <laughs> Though I confess I may have miscalculated slightly on my first try. <laughs> Gave quite the fright to some fittergoers in the West End. <laughs> it's been much too long. When I received your owl, I must uh, say I... Best not speak here, Eleazar. Hmm? Of course. Why don't we speak en route to Hogwarts? We have a start of term feast and a sorting ceremony to get to. Wonderful idea! As long as your young charge here doesn't mind me tagging along. Not at all, sir. After you. Ages since I've been to the castle. Would be good to see the old pile of rocks. Somebody is spying on us. Warner Bros. Games. This game looks amazing though. I love the intro on that. traveling companion a new student new yes sir I'm starting school as a fifth year how extraordinary it is indeed none of the faculty has ever heard of anyone being admitted to Hogwarts so late nor have I of course as the other fifth years will have been honing their magical skills for four years now the headmaster asked if I could get our new student up to speed a bit before the term begins well 
You couldn't have asked for a better mentor. Professor Fig is not only an exceptional teacher, he's also a remarkably intuitive and gifted wizard. Mr. Osric is prone to flattery. I dare say it's one of the reasons he's risen so far at the Ministry. <laughs> Have you seen this? I have. Opinions differ as to how great a threat Ranrock really is. Although I've yet to convince my colleagues at the Ministry, I believe he is a significant threat. And it was your wife, Eleazar, who alerted me to his activities months ago. Miriam? How? <sighs> she wrote to me about Ranrock before she died. Wondering what the Ministry knew about his activities. Before I could respond, I... ...received this. It was the last thing she sent me, Eleazar. It came to me via her owl. But with no correspondence, I can only assume... That she had to get rid of it quickly. To keep it safe. Presumably from Ranrock. I cannot open it. Whatever magic protects this is powerful indeed. It looks like goblin metal. That symbol. What's that glow? I don't see a glow. Nor do I. Merlin's beard. Of course we see How it. We're wait. special, aren't we? We do. Wigan World Potion. That stuff will write you in a second. What happened? Poor George. I can't believe he... What the hell got into that damn thing? Attacking a carriage mid-air? A typical dragon would never... Professor? <sighs> Sir, where are we? I'm not sure. But that key you discovered was clearly a port key. Port key? An item enchanted to bring whoever touches it to a specific place. I'm feeling better, sir, if you'd like to look around a bit. I would. But stay close. We've no idea who created this port key. Or why. Wow, look at that. How far did that port key take us? Farther from London than the carriage traveled. We're somewhere in the Scottish Highlands. Sir, those ruins. My God, the the, this view looks so there. good. I do. This has not been the day either of us expected. But Miriam sent that port key to George for a reason. And I believe that she, and now George, died in pursuit of whatever it was meant to lead to. If you're sure you're all right and wouldn't mind indulging me, I'd like to have a look around. Absolutely, sir. Good. 
Let's see if we can find a path, however faded it may be. Mind your step. Look at that. This game is so cool. Where do you suppose your wife got the pool key that brought us here? A good question. Miriam spent years searching for evidence of a long forgotten form of ancient magic. Ancient magic? Yes. A powerful magic wielded by a rare few that seems to have been lost to time. <laughs> Hogwarts Castle was built by and is itself a stronghold of that ancient magic. I don't know where she came into possession of the portkey, but I am certain it was to do with that search. Ah, that's the path down below. This way! But sir, why was your wife searching for evidence of lost magic? Miriam wanted to understand why such powerful magic disappeared from the wizarding world. Spoke of the good it could do. But magic is no different than any power. What really matters is the one who wields it. Is that ice? It's not cold enough here. It appears to be a sort of enchantment. Someone wanted to block this path. Let's see some of that wand work you were practicing. Focus on the center. So, that be to perform, perform a basic cast. RT. Okay, so right trigger. Oh, just tap it. Excellent. That was cool. Use your camera. Right, to select an active target. Some players prefer to select targets and move the avatar with the same thumbstick by disabling camera relative targeting in safe settings. I guess we're gonna try both ways. See how it goes. Yeehaw. That was a bit rougher than I'd expected. Your one works improving with every car. Thank you, sir. Got sixty four coins. We're close now, it's just ahead. Steady yourself.
Why would someone have built this here? I suspect they valued their privacy. That port key led us here for a reason. So let's have a look around for anything that seems out of place. So the minimap shows you your surroundings with you in the middle. This is your current objective. was a noted seer. Interesting. This may have been his home. That enchanted crystallized stone again. But what could it be blocking? What's this? Professor Fig! How odd. Why would someone have conjured that enchanted stone here? And how is there a room behind it? What room? I don't see anything. There's that glow again, like the glow on the port key container. What in Merlin's name? Godric's heart. Where are we? I don't believe it. Hello? Just a moment. <laughs> then stay close <whistles> after you
many votes are there? Hundreds. Hundreds. In fact, you'll see quite a few on our way to vote number 12. As we speak, we're just beneath the main lobby. The votes you see now are the newest. Are private entrances to the bank common at Gringotts? They are most uncommon. Only one with great wealth or power, or both, could have arranged for such a service. You'll want to take a breath. A what? That waterfall washes away all enchantments. It's a security measure. Experienced the thief's downfall before, have you? Heard of it? These are the lower vaults that we're passing now. How deep are we going? Vault number 12 was commissioned shortly after Gringotts was founded over four centuries ago. It resides in the deepest part of the bank. Settle in. We've quite a distance to go. time this vault was accessed. A goblin has been stationed at my desk for hundreds of years. In that time, no one has visited Vault 12 until today. While searching through a ruined castle. Oh, that's an interesting door. Thank you for your help. I wonder what are we going to find inside. So, what was he saying there? While searching through a ruined castle in Scottish Highlands, I happened upon a strange glowing doorway made of crystallized stone. Suddenly, Professor Fig and I found ourselves in an ornate vestibule. We remain unsure of what we will find. What do you suppose well, we should be looking for? I'm not sure. Sir, I wonder if you might... The instructions for Vault 12 indicate that I am to grant access to the holder of the key and then close the door. Wait! Mr. Black? <sighs> Professor? That was certainly unexpected. Let that me was think. surprising for me as well. There must be something here. Hmm. Revelio, perhaps. Revelio? Yes, a revealing charm. No time like the present. Let's see what we're missing, shall we? Ready your wand and focus. Ooh. So we get to learn our first new spell. Steady your wand with L and continue it guided along the symbol's path to learn the spell. Okay. Press the corresponding input when prompted to accelerate your wand's motion along the symbol's path. Okay, so I press A. Okay. okay. Second try. It's not that bad, actually. We might we might get to be a great wizard. Revelio. 
There, I saw something. Move a bit closer and try again. Oh, a, a door. door. Well, a that's door. a start. There's that symbol again. I don't suppose you see a way to... I do, Professor. That symbol has the same glow as the one I saw on the port key container. If what you can see reveals the way forward, then I dare say we are about to discover the secret of this vault. Lead the way. Lead the way. I shall. I shall do exactly just that. Lumos! This is no ordinary vault. I suspect we will need to earn our way out of here. What do you mean, earn our way out? Do you think this is some sort of test? I do. But to what end, I can't say. Stay close. There will be no disapparating if things go poorly. Not out of Gringotts. Revelio. There's nothing nearby apparently. Nothing hidden. I was hoping we're gonna find another chest. I see something up ahead. What is it? That glow again, but on the floor. Lumos! What happened? When I moved towards the glow, it suddenly seemed as if the ground was swirling about. Are you all right? Yes, sir. I'm fine. You seem to have caused the floor to change. That statue? What statue? I see some sort of statue, but only as a reflection in the floor. There must be something to that reflection. Revelio. I presume this is what you saw reflected in the floor. It is. The reflection's still there, but the statue's positions don't match. Wait. When you moved, the reflection turned in the direction of the light. Hmm. Perhaps you should cast Lumos. Alright, so we get to learn our second spell now. Hopefully we can get this one out of our first try. And yes, we do. We've acquired the one lightning charm, Lumos, which has automatically been slotted to your spell set. Lumos creates a light at the tip of your wand to help you see in dark areas. Okay. Hold LT. Lumos. Well done. Now the reflection is turning towards me. It does follow the light. Ex 
Professor! Professor Fig! Professor, where are you? This isn't good. Revelio! Where am I supposed to go? What's happening? The wisps of magic seem to be leading me somewhere. Lumos. Revelio. Lumos. That's where they're leading me. That glow again. Lumos. Revelio. I suppose I'm on my own this time. Protego. Lumos. It seems I have no choice. I'm going to have to fight my way out of here. Revelio. Lumos. Revelio. Lumos. Revelio.
Lumos. Rebellion. did you... What is this place? I don't know. But I found this floating above that... basin. That is no mere basin. That is a pensive... for viewing memories. I wonder... too well. I wonder if the path we've created may be impossible to follow. It will only be impossible for one who cannot see traces of ancient magic as I can. Your ability to see what others cannot will not be enough, Percival. We are entrusting the one who embarks on this path with powerful secrets, with knowledge others will do anything to obtain. Yes, and if we are correct, Charles, the witch or wizard who completes the trials will have proven themselves worthy of that knowledge and the responsibility that accompanies it. We've done all that we can. That's what you're seeing. The glow that surrounded them. Yes, sir. Astonishing. Can I see magic? Traces of an ancient magic, to be precise. The magic that Miriam had always believed existed, but could never. Miriam, and perhaps George, died in pursuit of knowledge that has been dormant for centuries. And you, it seems, are the key to understanding why. We were... It all looks rather different than it did a moment ago. <laughs> Someone's coming. Who were they? I don't know. But, sir, you shouldn't be in here. I was right. Ranrock. Seems my reputation precedes me. I was beginning to think no one was ever going to visit Rackham's Vault. And why are you here? No need for that. Just give me whatever it is you found here and we can let bygones be bygones. I'm not <coughs> giving you anything. Uh, You're sir, ugly. They had the key to the vault. <laughs> Choose your next words wisely. I... I only meant that 
the instructions to Vault 12 were quite clear. Sir, I, I must insist. I was to grant access only to one with the key, and you didn't have them. I have no patience for traitors. Now, where were we? I'm not giving you anything. Hmm. Well, perhaps your young friend here will be more helpful. <laughs> Are you all right? Fine, sir. I've never seen so powerful a goblin. He seemed wholly unaffected by my magic. Where are we? <laughs> it can't be. It seems those who set up the pensive, the locket, and the path to both wanted someone with your ability to end up here. Come. We have a sorting ceremony to get to. And finally, guys, welcome to Hogwarts. Oh my god, this looks so amazing. the sorting ceremony I'm no expert but that seems more appropriate now I need to study this locket as soon as I can but first I must contact the ministry they need to know what happened to George and be warned of Ranrock for the moment I ask that you keep all that's happened this evening between you and me of course sir thank you ready for the sorting ceremony Yourself to meet the headmaster. Fig, nice of you to join us. The sorting ceremony is over. There were complications. Complications? It seems the goblin Enough. problem. Enough. Goblins. I've no time for rumors, Fig, and I'm rapidly losing whatever patience I had left. 
If you're lucky, we might still be able to get you sorted this evening. <clears throat> I'll be in touch. Professor Weasley, we've one more to be sorted. Welcome. You're just in time. Have a seat. I'm so excited. We're gonna get to have our house picked. Fingers crossed we're gonna get ah, Gryffindor. Oh, yes. A bit older than the others, aren't you? You come Maybe. here with preferences and preconceptions. Certain expectations. Uh, to be honest, I never liked classes, so I'll go with I can't wait to explore. I'm looking forward to exploring Hogwarts and the world beyond the castle and grounds. Mm. Indeed. Much can be gleaned by having an adventurous spirit, but your professors have a great deal to teach you as well. Mm. I wonder... Gryffindor, Gryffindor, mm. Gryffindor. I detect something in you. A certain sense of... Mm. What is it? Sense of Daring. adventure? I like to think that I'm not afraid of anything. Mm. Oh, but you're brave at heart. Exceptionally daring. Undaunted by the unknown. Willing to forge ahead alone when you must. Perhaps you belong in Gryffindor. Yes. Gryffindor House, known for daring. Bravery and chivalry. Of course, I'm going to accept this house. That's exactly Better what I wanted. Be Gryffindor! And one more thing. Due to the unfortunate injury on the pitch in last spring's final, this year's Quidditch season has been cancelled. That's unfortunate. It's not as though I've banned flying altogether. But don't tempt me. You are here to focus on your academic futures. I'm sure you will have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. I said, I'm sure you all have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. This Nigeria is black. He's, uh, he's a bit rude. I'm he's Professor okay. Weasley, would you be so kind as to show our new student to their common room? I shall see to it, sir. As I was saying, I'm Professor Weasley. Pleased to meet you. Nice to meet you as well, Professor. As Deputy Headmistress, it is my distinct honor to show you to your common room. Right this way. It's most uncommon for a student to begin as a fifth year. This should be quite an adventure. I'm looking forward to it. I remember the first time I entered the Gryffindor common room after being sorted. You were a Gryffindor? I am a Gryffindor. Never could remember the password when I was a girl, however. Password? Password? The password is Grata Domum. Grata Domum. You may enter. Well done. Now, go on in and get some sleep. 
You have a big day ahead of you tomorrow. I shall be back in the morning to collect you for your first class. Thank you, Professor Weasley. You're welcome. I hope you enjoy your first night at Hogwarts. Sleep well. Looks like everyone's gone. Better head to the common room. Rebellion. Look at that guy waving us, waving at us. Hello there. You're right. Okay, guys. So I think uh, that's about enough for today. We have arrived at Hogwarts. We're gonna get to become a really well-known wizard, hopefully. So I will see you guys in the next episode as we will go into the coma room and start our adventure to through Hogwarts.